What's up creatives? Today we're gonna show you how to take any image and make it a vector in five minutes or less. Let's get into it. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is once you find an image, you open it in Photoshop. And so I have this eagle image. I'm gonna open it in Photoshop. And then first thing you wanna do is cut it out. So I'm gonna use the magic wand and I'm going to select my background and then I'm gonna hit delete. And then I'm going to hit Command Shift A to open up the camera raw filter in Photoshop. And I'm on a Mac, so I don't know what that is on Windows, but I'm gonna desaturate the image and I'm gonna bring my texture all the way up, my clarity all the way up. I'm gonna bring my whites all the way up and I'm gonna bring my shadows up a little bit. Create some contrast right here, bring the contrast up a little bit. And then I'm gonna hit okay, I like that. Just so there's some whites and darks. And then I'm gonna go image adjustments and I'm gonna go threshold. So you see what it just did there, kind of posterized it. And now we're going to save as a JPEG onto our desktop. So I'm just gonna label that Eagle. On my desktop, hit save. Um, doesn't matter about that. Okay, now I'm gonna go to my desktop and I'm gonna open my image that's a JPEG and Illustrator. Open with Illustrator. Now we'll click on our image, so you'll know you'll click on it by seeing the blue box selected around it. So we'll click on our image and then we'll go object and then we will go down to image trace and make and expand. Hit OK. It'll take maybe a second, maybe more, depending on how detailed the image is. So there we go, it just vectorized our image for us. And now I'm going to select my magic wand tool and Illustrator and I'm gonna select the white and I'm gonna hit delete Now what it did is just deleted all the white we have and now it left all it left was the black So now we have a vectorized eagle that we can use we can make it as big as we want And it won't get Pixelated we can make it as small as we want we can drop it on a t-shirt. We could drop it on a hat We could add text to it Literally, you could do anything you want, um, and this will work with pretty much any, any image. So all you're going to do is you're just going to always make sure you make the image black and white. You're going to hit the threshold, and then you're going to bring it over into Illustrator, and you are going to go Object, Make and Expand, and then you will have a vectorized image. I hope that helps. There you go. Cool, cool. That's gonna do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and got something out of it. If you did, please be sure to hit the like and subscribe button. It means the world to me. Please keep creating and keep sharing your art with the world.